Greetings Photoshop fans, today I'm going to go through the different shape tools that are available for Photoshop CS5. The custom shape tool is a path tool that allows you to create a custom shape based on a series of presets. The tool is best used for creating masks, but can be used for graphic design with creating shapes. This particular tool seems a bit less practical, but it can serve a variety of purposes. The tool is normally used for creating masks, but this particular part of the tool is probably best for graphic design. Click and hold on the button with a solid rectangle near the bottom of the toolbar, then drag down to the custom shape tool. Click and drag across the image to create a selection. Now what you can do with the selection depends on your skills with Photoshop. If you are new to it, then your options will be limited. But if you are somewhat familiar with masking and shapes, then this tool will prove very useful. As I said before, you can create shapes filled in with colors and separate layers, but the most common use for this tool is creating masks. Now let's take a look at the above options panel. The first option will be the Shape Layers button. This allows you to automatically create shapes on your image that will be separate layers. The second button is Paths. This allows you to create selections that can be made into masks for image manipulation. The third is Fill in Pixels. This will simply create a shape that is filled with color and is uneditable. The second part of the Top Options panel allows you to quickly swap between the different path creation tools. This shows how the pen and shape tools are united as one main function. Using all three to their maximum potential allows you to create very precise and controllable masks, making for very easy photo manipulation. One extra option you have with this particular shape tool is the ability to change what the shape is. It comes with a lot of presets, and if you really know what you're doing, you can upload custom shapes. The third part of the tool allows for different options on path and shape customization. You can add path areas and allow for combining paths, you can subtract from them, you can intersect paths, and you can create paths that exclude other overlapping paths. The tool is initially very simple, but it grows in complication and power as you learn to use it. It's definitely a tool for the patient as you get to know it, but it will prove completely worth it when you see what it can do. Thanks for watching. You can send any questions or requests about Photoshop to requests at mahalo.com, and please be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe below.